Hello and welcome back. Sorry about the silence, but hello and welcome back to some more of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. I am going to be loading up and I can't remember if we were like right in the middle of a monster fight or if we had just taken care of them. So that's why there is no music because I was just on the load screen and I was like, oh wait, I can't remember if I killed those guys or not. I do remember the save point being like right next to Tuba Coblin, so we're gonna get the live screen on a little sooner than usual and see what's going on. Today, uh, maybe quite a short stream again. Again, I'm sorry I'm so, it's so late, but the fireworks been really bad with my poor dog being very upset. <coughs> so we haven't been getting a lot of sleep and I am a very tired girl. Um... We, I actually left the map slice I was exploring because I keep dying so easily, so I would really like some more armor upgrades, and there was a fairy, what's up GT, hope you're doing well, there was a fairy not too far away, uh, looks like we're gonna have to do some, something to get the musicians over to this fairy, but let's go see what we're gonna get into, and how big of a pain in the butt this is gonna be. I'm doing okay, how are you doing? <coughs> <coughs> I'm really tired. The 4th of July is not a good holiday in this household. This poor dog is just terrified. Alright, did I kill those guys or not? Looks like I did. Alright, then in that case, let's go talk to the musicians and see about getting them across here. Doesn't look like any mus uh, noise is coming through this. Let me fix that. There we go. Sorry about that. <coughs> what am I wearing? Oh, I got my sneaky clothes on. No, I don't. The glide shirt looks a little bit too much... Uh, it doesn't look anything like my sneaky clothes, but it's like tight like the sneaky clothes and I keep thinking it is the sneaky clothes. I don't really want to talk to these people yet until we unlock this slice of the map. There's the man of the hour. Look or thi look at this, or rather, listen. It's Beats, our stalwart drummer. Beats has returned. Oh. A sorry troop leader I am, making my band members worry about me that way. What they really ought to be worried about is our declining audience. Oh yeah, it's not looking great, huh? But the beating heart of the stable trotters pulses once more. Three cheers for our own beats. Oh. I'm brimming over with happiness to the point I can't keep a lid on it. And I must say, it's good to see a friendly face. One who no doubt shares my concern for the great fairy. Oh. Ugh, I must be mistaken. Oh, I think I s said the wrong thing. I merely assumed that because the great fairy Cotera is such a notable attraction at a dueling peak stable. Oh. Alas, the local great fairy hasn't emerged from her flower bud in quite some time. I'm sure she's scared to come out just like the great fairy at the woodland stable. <laughs> she used to listen to Beats' drums so fondly. Hearing his lively beat again will be just the thing to cheer her up, but... <laughs> but this Gerudo lady won't let us through, man. We try to walk across the bridge so many times and she's like, No, you shall not pass. She's like cosplaying Gandalf or something. What's going on around here? <laughs> the bridge to the great fairy is broken. How are horses supposed to cross? Oh. Yo, if the bridge is no good, how about we cross the river? Yeah, yeah. That's right. We can cross the river. 
to the river, everyone, all together now. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure the great fairy will give you her blessing. <sighs> that violin is so nice. <laughs> sorry, everyone. It's really like, sorry to concentrate on voice acting. This guy real goofy when it's so and so and pretty. I'm sure the great fairy will give you her blessing when she wakes up. If you have the time, I'd be honored if you could be there for our performance. <laughs> it's so beautiful. All right. Serenade to Koterra. So we gotta make a raft. But what? What's gonna pull a raft, though? Isn't it just gonna flow down the river and get stuck in the rocks? Maybe I need to use my magic powers to like pull them across. I don't know. Let me talk to them one more time. I'm pretty sure they're gonna want me to put wood on the bottom of their cart. Let's just double check. The bridge is a bust. I mean, you guys could walk across. I don't know what these guys have against using their legs. <laughs> but I thought it might not be so hard to cross the river. I see now that I was mistaken. Even if we took off our breezes wheels and floated across the river, the current would run that plan aground. Oh. The great fairy is so near, yet so far. I have absolutely no idea what to do. Our breeze was built for traveling roads, not rivers. Oh, fans and stuff, duh. I keep forgetting like the whole shtick of this game. If we tried to ford it, we'd all sink before we reached the great fairy's side. That's right. <laughs> I have magic powers and machines. I spent maybe an hour trying to figure it out. I just like, and also, what's up? Eek shell is hungry. Lovely to see you. I keep like not using this stuff because my favorite thing about Zelda games is going virtual hiking. And so then, whenever it comes time to actually solve a puzzle, I'm like, but, <laughs> but there's a current in the river. It's not gonna work. <laughs> things are, things don't work like that. It's not the rules. <laughs> But, but, the game is different than this. <laughs> and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm magic. Everybody's afraid of my magic, but I am magic. And I have superpowers and technology on my side. <laughs> Just if I could only remember that fact. That doesn't look very stable. Maybe they want me to put it on the big one instead. I was gonna put it on two little ones. Hang on, everyone. That was pretty good. I'm, I'm good. How are you? Uh, let me know how to pronounce it. I want to say it right. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm very tired. I've got this perfect dog that I love more than most things on planet Earth. And she's very afraid of fireworks. And I'm from Southern California, so we just had the 4th of July yesterday, our Indep American Independence Day. And we did not get a lot of sleep. Oh my goodness. It was a rough, rough night. What's that thing over there? You pronounce it very good. Hooray! Everybody's so, so, something silly about this game, in my opinion, is like, we live in Hyrule, right? Everything is crazy all the time. There's always like wizards and monsters and magicians and like, there's all kinds of crazy stuff going on, right? And all these people act like <laughs> me having telekinetic powers is the craziest thing they've ever heard of, which I find very funny. Like, y'all, we're stuck in some kind of insane reincarnation cycle. This is like, this is not the first Zelda game. 
<laughs> but telekinesis is where we draw the line, exactly. <laughs> like, oh, the flying wizard shooting firestorms. Like, yeah, that's normal. We saw that last Tuesday. But you moving stuff with your mind? That's a bridge too far, my friend. <laughs> but you can't help us for free anyways. <laughs> I'm loving this game. I still think I prefer Breath of the Wild thus far, but I've been playing really slowly because I do just like to hike around a ton. I don't think we need this, and I'm gonna take it anyways. Maybe they should be afraid of me because I just chuck stuff out of the air <laughs> like that. All right. What? <laughs> Everybody get in the boat. The bridge is a bust, but I thought it might not be so hard to cross the river. I see now that I was mistaken. I have absolutely no idea what to do. Get in. Such joy, elation. The very words I've been waiting for. I want to cosplay this girl. She's so cute. Everyone! I don't know what these musicians have against using their functional legs, though. There's a workaround bridge. They could just walk. They won't walk anywhere. Everywhere I've taken them to has been not that far away. Everyone, get on board before he changes his mind! I'm gonna give you a lecture the entire way across the river. Just so you know! Alright, everybody. Let's have a discussion about how important it is not to be lazy. Eek, what's going on? The breeze or is rocking. Oh, it's not very firmly attached. Well, sorry. What's up, Fairlina? Hope you're doing well today. <laughs> this looks fun. What's happening? Please don't jostle our delicate a breeze. It's very delicate. You're very delicate. <laughs> Is there any way for me to attach this thing more? I guess I should have done two separate pieces. These guys are weenies. Ah, stop that! We're never gonna get across if you keep complaining. Alright. I'm not sure if this is gonna float. I'm, I'm not feeling well. After all that, I can't do this anymore. We didn't even get started yet. We should head back. All right, fine. I'll build them a nicer raft. God, they're picky. I think that looks like fun. <laughs> it's like a free fair ride. Oh. Please don't jostle the breezer too much when we're in it. Spare a thought for your poor passengers. This is what happens when you refuse to walk and you're perfectly capable of doing so. If one of you has some kind of hidden disability, feel free to tell me and I will take that person across the river with zero lectures. The rest of you are lazy and you can walk. <laughs> okay. Whoa, look at that. Whoa. That was fun. Oh, look at that beautiful tree. Okay. Let's give them... We're gonna have to probably fully rebuild this thing. You guys are such weenie babies. Beggars can be choosers, but these beggars are real choosy. Yeah, they are. My goodness gracious. They're very demanding for wanting free labor. And they're very like... Oh, about me using my magic powers. Like... Build it yourself. <laughs> Build it yourself then. These guys, I swear. I liked them at first, but... I don't know. I don't truck with that level of laziness, I don't think. <laughs> She's slamming it down. Whoops. Let's 
put that. I guess really we would want the fan to blow into the sail, not away from it, huh? <laughs> They're gonna be like, Oh, there's a breeze on the back of our breezer. I can't bear it, my delicate skin constitution. <laughs> I don't have a very high opinion of these guys. Oh, my hair. It's becoming must. However will I survive? <laughs> The breeze is ruining my hair! That's exactly what I was thinking. Oh dear! We shan't make it through the day! <laughs> now, if you don't get in soon, they're gonna be like, What? How did our poor breeze get all the way over there? Let's get it back right away! This man. At least he didn't bring it. That is no average wagon or common cart. It's as much a performing member of our troop as any of us. It would simply be a disaster for our traveling band if our dear vehicle ever got away from us. <laughs> like how the thing keeps spinning around crazy. This world isn't walnut. I can only ride on walnut, birch, or cherry. A oh, rich cherry, this man. That's a perfect, a perfect, <laughs> perfect emote for this guy. No. I have absolutely no idea what to do. Yeah, yeah. Such joy, such elation. Everyone, get on board before he changes his mind. Yeah, yeah. What's up, knives? How you doing? What, what's this? <sighs> we can't get into Breeza if something's where we sit. You sit on the edge of the thing, huh? You guys are jerks. You have... These people have bad manners. Oh wow, why is it moving so much? Oh here, let's just because they're so if it moves that much, they're gonna be like, oh dear! My delicate constitution! So let's just nip that in the bud. Wait, this is attached? Then why was it moving so much? This is why it took me an hour to help these freeloaders. <laughs> I mean, they got good axles on this thing, I guess. I'm surprised you didn't yell at me for knocking it into the rocks. It won't attach now? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm going fast. Well, poop. Let's try to take this one off and see if we can attach it to... Are they gonna yell at me if I tip this over? Don't say a word to me. Ma Mastro, you jerk. What? This thing has incredible balance. All right, you guys do have a pretty good wagon, I guess. I'm surprised they didn't complain about this. Now, still gonna move around a lot, right? Is it not? Does it only have an axle on the back side? Surely not. Let's just try to make sure that's not gonna be a problem.
Actually, I need a place to steer. So let's put it like this. Hopefully. <laughs> Limo wagon boat Boeing 747. <laughs> it's an all-in-one vehicle. Can I stand there and pilot that? I sure hope so. I feel like we probably need the sail, but they keep complaining about everything, so I'm gonna try without it. Oh no, it's still moving. All right, get in, you jerks. The bridge is a bust. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Yeah, yeah. Such joy. We could have been done if you guys wouldn't be such weenies. <laughs> the breeze is rocking. We barely started. Don't be such a baby. Oh my god. You guys are the worst. It's sinking. <laughs> I'm up to my neck. Look at him. <laughs> this is truly a seaworthy craft. Oh crap, I ran out of batteries. They're gonna be like, oh dear, it's raining. We can't perform the rain. Oi! The great fairy! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> places, everyone! Places! The great fairy needs us! But not so much that we'll use our legs. Was beautiful. The fairies creep me out. Uh -huh. That's three out of four. Mario. You love the fairies, do you? They really creep me out. Oh, oh we've done it. Ah. Yowza. I think my heart just picked up the tempo. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the musical stylings of the stable trotters are the cure for anyone's malaise. He likes yeah, the fairies. Yeah. Thank you once again. I've prepared a token of thanks so substantial that I hope your pockets are double stitched. <laughs> Just driving a boat with the water up to my neck. Like, this is fine. <laughs> you deserve every last bit. Silver Ruby. I want to lead these guys in some, like, leg exercise. Let's do squats. <laughs> so you guys can use your legs. Yeah, yeah. Just, like, if you're a musician, I feel it's a- I mean, it's just- you're a person, it's important to keep your body in as good a shape as you possibly can. And now that my own pockets are lighter, I can concentrate on the performance. Are they gonna play some more? Yeah, yeah! I'm proud to say the great fairy Kotera is at peace. I, did you kill her? But she wasn't the last great fairy still shut away in her flower bond. Yeah, yeah. That is why we must be off at once to visit the next great fairy. Thank you for your invaluable assistance. No problem. <laughs> I'm happy to help. I'm just gonna complain about it a lot. Oh, I thought they would, maybe they would play some more. <laughs> oh, what a feeling. That first breath of an... They put all of their energy into their arms for peak me they're like absolutely jacked on the top of little stick legs. Oh, what a feeling. The first breath of fresh air. It's just so intoxicating. The beat of the drum has lit a fire deep in my heart. Mm. And what about you? Can you feel the heat? 
Are you ready for more? This is why I don't like the fairies. They creep me out. Like, I'm a child. Get away from me. Allow me to enhance your clothing. It's the least I can do. But I will need the necessary materials. Ah. With the power available to me, I can greatly enhance your clothing. Mm hmm? Wahoo! Oh, yay! Sneaky clothes! My favorite outfit. Ooh, I'm gonna have to get some more sticky frogs. Let me think about this for a minute. My shorty shorts? Ooh! How much money is she gonna charge me? Probably a fortune. 200 rupees! Holy moly! This, I don't know if I'll ever be able to upgrade. I've not fought one Lionel in this game. <laughs> like, the book hoblins knock me instantly. Still. Ooh, climbing gear. Let's do sneaky clothes, because it's my favorite outfit. Mm. All right, let me do my thing. Lady, you're going to rob me. Ugh. Stop. Consent is important. <laughs> Consent is important. A Sheikah made mask. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, yes. Done. I hope you like it. I don't uh, like you very much. Don't kiss me, you creep. Mm -hmm. All right. We need more frogs and snails. Let's see what else can I do. We could do this one. Oh, we could get some of this stuff. I have a notebook where I write down what I need, but it's okay. I won't do it right now. We'll just upgrade what we can and then I'll do this off stream. Probably gonna do that one. No, I would like to do this mm. one, I think. Mm. All right, let me do my thing. Look, all I'm saying is if a giant woman came out of a hole in the floor and was a little friend too friendly, I wouldn't complain. But I get where you're coming from. All they want to do is see a woman come out of a hole. A giant woman. A giant woman. <laughs> they just... They're a little too forward for me. I'm a bit shy. <laughs> Look. With this level of quality, it's hardly recognizable. Ah. Mm -hmm. I could be into a giant woman as long as like there's a conversation first. <laughs> like just come in for a kiss when your lips are twice the size of my entire body. It's a little terrifying. Um, I got my goofy glow pants. I'll probably do the climbing stuff. Hmm. Are you sure you want me to enhance the climbing gear? Mm. All right, let me do my thing. I'm also shy, but I love when people are very out and forward. I... I think I need a little bit of warming up. <laughs> I was like, what are you doing to me? What? Why? I'd be afraid they'd eat me. <laughs> They're huge. There, yeah, take it. Ah. Do you want me to enhance any of your other clothes? And they're in this big mm -hmm. puddle. They just like pull me down and drown me. It's terrifying. Um, should I do this too? I think I will. Mm. Yes, mm. I think I can enhance your Hylian trousers. Her accent's kind of going a little bit all over the place. I'll get it back. I'd like to make them all sound like slightly different. But I don't think I have so far. It's just a little thing, but I hope it helps. Ah. Can you still mm. enhance clothes? Oh, these glowing stuff? Mmm. I think I needed moblin guts for something else that I wanted more. Dazzle fruit. Large zone height. The accent is a nice touch. I was trying to go like Marilyn Monroe, but I feel like I'm going a little more like Betty Boop lately. <laughs> We could do these. They might glow more. I think I forgot to take allergy medicine. The fairy Betty Boop. Yeah, I was trying to like 
trying to do a Marilyn Monroe, but it just didn't quite come out that way this time. Thank you for the follow. Just one second, I need to wipe my nose. So for anyone who is new here, including Xshell, I stream usually around 11 a.m. Pacific, but because of the fireworks, I haven't been sleeping much, and neither has my dog. I'm like very late. And I usually do Zelda throughout the week and then something else on Sundays. And before this came out, I was playing other stuff. I play like farming games and like chill stuff. Uh, possible cobbling guts. What's that? A Gibdo bone? I've never seen that ever. That's going to probably be real scary. This man, I wish someone could just cheat me in a couple of Lionel parts. Ah. I don't think I'm going to do this yet, because I'm pretty sure there was something else I needed mob with guts for, and I'll worry about it off stream. You can call me Kevin. It's easier. Most people call me Kevin. Okay, you might have to remind me a couple times, but I'll try. I have one more sister who has also lost hope for this world and withdrawn and swept but... Are you okay, mamas? If you reinvigorate her as well... I will have the power to enhance your clothes even more. Ah! I hear that my big sister Kesa is at a stable near the Gerudo region to the west. See you later. <laughs> Aya! <laughs> She's not gonna eat you. She's gonna karate chop you. No! More face! Alright. So, I'm not actually, I don't actually want to be here right now, I just wanted, I wanted the upgrades. What I've been doing is, the way I play these games is I usually unlock a map section, and then I like painstakingly hike my way down it and explore everything. And we did this little, no, wait, which one did we, did we do? Do, 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 do? This is why I do it like this, because I lose track. We did this little section, the last few streams. And I did part of this, but I didn't go back up the edge of the coast, which I would think I would like to do today. I did see those nasty hens around here somewhere, so I gotta be careful. Um, and then, I think we're just gonna go exploring today. Just do a bunch of hiking and see what we can find. Should be great. You can go back to Kakariko Village. Buy some more arrows. I'm always down for that. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Thanks for being so welcoming, JT. Did you get all your summer clothes bought, JT? You said you were shopping like a yesterday or a couple days ago? So out of it, I don't know what happened when. Oh yeah, and that jerk still won't let me go do whatever I want to do and I wanted to get up there. Hmm. You're gonna scare the beetle away. What are you doing? Bugoot. Arrows, arrows, arrows. Cook me up, lady. Yes. Oh. How many? And that's not how she said it. So, all of them? They'll run you 50 rupees. How does that sound? Oh. My, my. Eager, aren't we? Oh. How many? You know I'm gonna buy all of them, lady. Oh. I buy all of them every single time. I'll take these wow. eyeballs, too. Might as well. Oh. Hook me up. Alright, bye. <laughs> okay, let's see. How's my food supply? Oh, I could probably use some more stamina stuff, but I think this is fine for now. usually prefer to do my cooking off-stream when I can. This jerk won't let me through. He's so diligent. He's way too good at his job of preventing me from doing what I wish to do. Get out of my way. Caleb. <laughs> you again? Under Princess Zelda's orders, everyone is strictly forbidden from getting close to that ring. If that applies to an archaeologist like me, <laughs> it certainly applies to an amateur like you. Oh, I have... I, my, I want too much of everything in these games. Now I just lost an arrow. Alright, so we need more of those sticky frogs. 
Wait, what was that? Ooh, free mushroom. Uh, I probably should go explore the way I intended to explore. Let's go to the stable and we'll check out the well and we'll go down the coast just to make sure I didn't miss anything. I, I get a lot of stuff in these games, and I also use a lot of stuff in these games. I think I had like over 700 bright, bright bloom blo blossoms, and I, I used them all. <laughs> I had to go replenish. And I also think I had like 400, two, something like 200 to 400 bombs, and I used them all. <laughs> And arrows. I'm so bad at the combat, especially in this one since it's harder than Breath of the Wild in my opinion. And so mostly I just shoot arrows. I don't do a lot of fighting and like melee combat. Give me those frogs. Some people in chat will be like, just go down there, and I'm like, absolutely not. There's monsters down there. <laughs> no! Juno, be gentle, mama. Alright, what was that? Rivali's pine cone. I don't think I've done any of the quest stuff around here. Whoops, sorry, I scared the birds away again. What kind of dog do I have? Uh, she's a shelter dog. I think she might have a lot of Shiloh Quintly in her, which is a Mexican hairless dog, but like a coated one, because she looks exactly like the purebred ones. Let's see. Oh, beetle! Get some arrows for me, my man. Oh, were you looking for me? I'm honored. But Beetle doesn't play favorites. Oh, what's this? Oh. Uh, that's an energetic rhino beetle. You don't see those beauties often. You, you'll give them to me, right? <laughs> what a hasty elixir. Sure, whatever. Fine. Yeah. Oh, wait. Thank you. <laughs> you don't see one of these every day. Sa, sa. You know what I'm here for, Beetle. <laughs> what do I always come to you for? <laughs> Arrows, my man. Yay! Yay! Here you go. Wow. Enjoy. Bye. <laughs> I pull her up and show you, but she's asleep on the floor right now. Splash fruits. Saba saba. Saba saba. Mm -hmm. You ever tried busting open one of those splash fruits? If you hit them or smash them against something, water comes splashing out. You can use them to put out fires, or I lost whatever accent I used to do with these. Or cool yourself down on a hot day. If you ask me, they're essential for travel. Say, that pitch wasn't half bad. Perhaps I have a future in fu and fruit vending. Maybe. Bye, Laroba. What did you want again? Hmm. What did Princess Zelda need those farm tools for? I have a wild guess that it's because only weapons decay during the upheaval. And that will mean... Oh. No, we need facts. I heard that a man named Isra spoke to the princess. I think he watches over the raft at this stable. All right, we can go talk to him. I think that we're like where we wanted to be anyways. Boop. Oh yeah, I tried to steal this guy's raft and he was like, hey, that's mine, you can't have it. I will have these fish. All the, uh, oh. all the Rito have, like, deep south accents. Sorry, I'm a little busy right now. Oh, oh I was wondering when you guys would show up. 
You work with Ben from the newspaper, right? You look like a child. I should have given you a younger sounding voice. I didn't want this to get out because I don't want people to think I'm saying bad things about Princess Zelda. I mean, that makes sense. Insulting the monarchy is probably a dangerous thing to do. But she borrowed our Staples farm tools and hasn't given them back. Is it Disney eyes? Ah, That was a long time ago. But I do remember she said she needed them for something at Florent Sandbar. It's around the river, just around the riverbed, just around the riverbed. She took our tools just around the riverbed. And then a good distance after that. Uh. <laughs> I'd take the raft there myself. What's up, Scud Mom? How you doing today? But after all that stuff fell from the sky, I'm having a hard time getting down the river. <laughs> so you might say I'm in a bind. Ah. Uh. I know. We could clear up this mess if someone could take me down river to Florence Sandbar on the raft. I could take you down Florence Sandbar on the raft. My tooth hurts. Well, I have a, a crown on one of my teeth and I think the filling fell out of it. Got some work going on in your trailer. Ooh, nice. Good eye, Glow. How you going? How are you? Good morning, sunshine. I hope you're doing well today. You just missed a stuffed up allergy having Pocahontas over here singing about the river bend. What are you doing in your trailer? Doing lovely as per usual. Good, I'm glad to hear it. Did you have a good 4th of July? How'd the pup do? Juniper did not have a good night and neither did I. Link, please work with me, my man. What? <laughs> this guy's a little more chill than most people are about my magical powers. I think I heard it, getting the man across the seven seas. <laughs> Moving a ceiling fan and installing a new one. Nice. I think it would be nice to have ceiling fans. We had them in the house I grew up in, but I don't have them in my current apartment. Wow, a whole lot of floor fans. Alright, as we get on. I wonder why Princess Zelda won't give the stables tools back. I want to go down the river to the floor at Sandbar and find out what's happened. But I'm having a hard time with the raft. Ah. Pup did already. I guess I hope mom was in bed. So I'm sure. Aww. Poor baby. What? You mean that fella? Oh, you mean that fella? You mean that? Comma, fella? He'll take me to Florent Sandbar? Oh. You missed your bit last night. Aww. What were you streaming last night? Thanks. I can't tell you how much I appreciate you offering to do that. Don't forget to cut the rope when you're ready to launch. I don't know if I have any cutting tools left. <laughs> I'm gonna install a ceiling fan, but way too worried about A, mounting it, and B, the electrical. I definitely wouldn't. I do not think I would do it myself. I think I would hire someone to help me. I don't know much about... Well, that's dangerous. You're the one who told me to cut the rope! <laughs> Florence Sandbar. Where is it? I hope there's not a lot of monsters in the way. Oh wait, down river. <laughs> is this it? Wow, he wants to go far. I bet there will be careful at the riverbed. Just beyond the riverbed. I look what's more just beyond the riverbed, beyond the shore, somewhere past the sea, don't know what for. What a dream the day might say, just beyond the riverbed, just past those ruins. <laughs> Sorry everyone. This is a nice way to spend a day. Nothing in particular. Just doing a lot of stream fixes. Ah, bit of racing in Forza. Got Shelby a new car. 
Went to pick up Shelby or Sherby. Nix and you with the unreasonable speed of my car collections. Ooh, I want to see your car. I want to see your cars. We're going on a road trip. I figured you meant Sherby. I think I see a lot of monsters over there. You sure about this, my man? Stop it, you're that dog. Please? Could you say please to me? This is your tour guide on what's the name of this river? Uh, I don't know the name of the river. <laughs> this is your tour guide. We will be docking shortly. If you look to the right, you can see one of Hyrule's many famous dragons. If you look to your left, you can see rocks. I mean, it's not gonna oh. hurt him to be polite. Woohoo, we made it! <laughs> we brought a weapon, Brad! <laughs> ah. You did a great job getting us here. Where'd you learn how to handle a raft like that? Uh, well, I went whitewater rafting once and I did a lot of kayaking on the ocean. It's like one of my favorite sports and I don't know. You just, I mean, it's, it doesn't take a genius. You just figure it out. I thought it would be a rough run, but I did too. It all turned out fine. Hey, thanks for the song, man. It made the journey go quicker. Ah. Uh, up in the sky, there's something, uh, someone coming at us. Hi, princess. Hmm. Ooh, finally caught up with you too. I was flying around this whole area. <laughs> I was, let me try that again. I was flying around this whole area, partner, trying to find out facts when I saw you on this raft. I figured you'd chase down our story, so I flew right on down the hill. But, uh, where are we? Huh? <laughs> We're like barely far away. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Just barging in here? This place is for flowers and plants. All of them precious. You'd better watch out. You'll rue the day you trample on any of them. I get it. <laughs> Look at his face. I'd be the same. If someone came in my garden stomping around, I'd be furious. Whoa, who's this? Ever met her before, partner? I have, actually. Ah. So sorry, ma'am. We're just looking for some farm tools that I... Oh, I stole all those tools. Whoops, hope they respond. Look at his face. <sighs> Sorry, so, sorry, ma'am. We're just uh, looking for some farm tools that I lent to Princess Zelda a ways back. I promise we won't pick any flowers. Uh, picking them? I'm more worried about you kicking them. Wait a minute, farm tools? Did you say something about farm tools? Uh, That's right, some farm tools from our stable. I want them back. Oh, well, that's my fault. I have them. This area is home to Princess Zelda's plant sanctuary. She asked me to take care of this special place with her. She loved these plants and spent a lot of time here making sure the garden- Look at this guy shivering. This is what my dog looked like last night. Ugh. Making sure the garden beds were happy homes for them. We meant to return the tools after we finished our work here. Oh. But the princess, well- they say she went missing. Oh. And all our hard work was ruined when... Oh, these darn ruins. <laughs> these darn ruins crashed down. It's been really awful. I've been working so hard since then to try to make it all nice again. Uh. Really? That's what happened? Now I think about it, I didn't tell the princess how soon I needed our stable's tools back. Oh. As long as they're in good condition, it's no problem. I'll just go ahead and take them with me if you're done. Now I feel guilty for some reason. Didn't mean to make you blah blah. blah. Try that one again. Didn't mean to make you hurry it up. Hmm. Oh, this was about a sanctuary for plants and flowers, huh? 
Sounds just like our princess to find time to work on a garden alongside folks while restoring Hyrule. Ah, uh, I've tried to make these garden beds as perfect as they were before. It's just so hard on my own. If only someone would help. Ah! Sure, glad to help. But keep the tools a little longer. And here's a tip. Don't overwork the soil. And also, nope, that's all I got. Uh, what's with the face? Wow! You said you'll help. I accept your offer. She's gonna put him to work. This is so cute. What? I didn't say that. Ma. Well, close enough. So, what if you don't say what you really think? I won't hold that against you. Now, how about you go work that soil like you said, and I'll go tend to the flowers. Well, this whole garden back in beautiful shape by the time the princess returns. It'll be the pride of Hyrule. Oh, and here's a tip for me. Put your back into it. Ah. I can't talk my way out of this one. Uh, she, uh, probably wreck the tools if she used them wrong. What's wrong with this guy? Okay, fine. Seems like I'm up the creek without a paddle here. Or doubt it. Either way, I'll help. <laughs> oh. You can go. Oh, he's so rude. I'll stay here. What else have I got to do, right? Okay. I mean, he did say he would help, right? Like, don't offer help ah. if you're not willing to do it. Well, seems like we got those facts we wanted. And those two worked it all out, I guess. I can't wait to write this up. Our readers love glimpses and... Blah, 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 blah. I can't wait to write this up. Our readers love glimpses into the princess's life. Here she was, helping to create a garden. Expect the story in an issue of the paper soon. It'll be a real headline. Mm. We work together to chase three of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Ah. You know, I don't think anyone would take you for a rookie with how hard you work working these investigations. <coughs> I'm sure Tracy appreciates your efforts. Is she gonna give me some clothes? Go on and add this to your nest egg, partner. I'd just steal him if I could. <laughs> Purple Rippy. Oh. oh, that's right. Tracy has had nothing but nice things to say about you, partner. Seems like there's a little extra something in your compensation this time around. No surprise there. Red Rippy. I'm off to report back to Tracy. See you around, partner. Sapa! So long. I feel like I lost his voice a little bit too. It's close, but mm, not quite what it used to be. I want a garden. I love gardening. I have to hurry. I have to hurry. Wow. Now then, there's no time to rest. You can't hurry gardening. <coughs> oh, you can't hurry gardening. No, you just have to wait. <laughs> Things will just grow on command. I need to restore Hyrule's best garden as soon as possible so it's ready for when the princess returns. Don't worry. It's me playing. You've got probably another hundred hours. <laughs> You'll be fine. Wait, is this where I got the Saflina? <gasps> it is! I need this stuff for armor upgrades. Let me quickly grab these things. Thank you! I love doing voice acting. I gave like every character- I gave- I try to give every character in Breath of the Wild a unique voice. And I try to do it here too. Yes, 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 yes. I need to mark this place. I decided I was gonna try to use this. To indicate like, there's a resource here that you can go and gather. Hey, buddy. I have a feeling you guys are gonna end up dating. Aww. All I wanted was those missing farm tools. I didn't expect anything like this. But for Princess Zelda, I'll work my hardest. Alright, enjoy! I think I got them all. Other than the colored ones? I wish they had text tags. Like, I, 
I complain about this a lot. Like, I would love to be able to just type, even if it was just a few characters, just to be able to type something in there to be like, flowers. <laughs> or like, there's another one I marked. Where was it? Uh, like, this isn't as apples are around here, I think. Which, like, obviously. And where was another one? I don't know. That's the problem, though, is that like, I don't remember what is where. I just know there's something there that I'm going to want later. Alright, well... Then... Let's work our way up the... Coast again, I, guess, I suppose. Guessing the boat is gone? Yep, it sure is. Tax tags would be so helpful! Yep. I'm always saying if if I could mod this game, the very first thing I would download would be something to disable the slowness effect in snow. And then I would download something for text tags, and I think there's one other thing that I would really like. Just like a little quality of life improvement. Or I can't think of what it is right now. They're good games, it's just a few things I really wish I had. Oh, I think those nasty hands were over there. I do not want to catch those hands. Ooh, Rivali's Pinecone. The only problem with my Deep South accents for the Rito is the voice actors they chose for them, like the, the sections are voice acted, are very American accents. They sound like anime characters, like American dubbed anime characters. So then it's like, everybody sounds a little something like this. Except for the main character, he kind of sounds like he's in a 90s TV cartoon. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up with this accent. Maybe I'm adopted. All the other birds sound different than me. Not some. Don't ask questions that you don't want the answer to. But I just want to go help Link, Dad. I can't grapple with these things right now. <laughs> it's like... I think I'd try to make, in this one, make his mom sound more American. Because she didn't have as many voice, like, voice acted lines. So I'm like, well, maybe, maybe there are Rito all over the world. Just the ones that live over here sound like they're from the Deep South. And the other ones have different accents. And so he just got it, like picked up his mom's accent. <laughs> and I had some accent for the Zora, but I cannot remember what it was. So I'm just gonna either have to look up my videos on YouTube and see if I want to stick with whatever I had, or which I might do, because I like the I like the idea of that continuity. Or maybe just make up something new. It's time for- whoops. I said it's time for photojournalism. Oh, we already got it. Maybe I should eat some apples. Hmm, I'm about to get in big trouble from these Lizalfos. I think I needed Lizalfos parts for one of those armor upgrades. But I don't really feel like fighting right now. I'll take that cricket. I think we pretty much explored this area. So, <coughs> excuse me, my goodness. Let's... Should we do the wetlands, maybe? <laughs> yeah, I do! Do you think I was kidding? <laughs> if I have less than 300 apples, I complain. And I would like more of these as well, because they're very useful. And these, too. I had, like, several hundred, but now I only got 77? Hmm... I like to have at least 150 of everything. <laughs> if I have less than that, I don't like selling it. Here's my collection. Ooh, we got another diamond somewhere. That's nice. These things I've only got like one or two of. It makes me feel panicked. 
753 zone night. That's so impressive. So I play, I play, I try to do all the story stuff on stream. And then when I play off stream, which I haven't been doing much because I just got done being really sick. I will like just go gather stuff. I'll go pick up, you know, a hundred new apples. I'll go get a hundred, like, well, I would like to get a hundred bombs. I'll go get like 60 bombs or something. And 753 zone night, yeah. Our friend Coronan told me to get as much as I could, so I did. <laughs> so I did. <laughs> I like having a lot of stuff. You should see me play Minecraft. I feel so validated. Makes sense. Oh, you have a higher voice. I've had it with cleaning the stable. Whoa. Let's see. What's in this issue of the Lucky Clover Gazette? Mm. Goron's ravenous for red rocks. Well, that's interesting. There has been an uptick, uptick, uptick in nefarious activities by some members of the Goron tribe. Ooh, nefarious Gorons? I make them sound like Southerners, usually. Travelers to Goron City, beware. Oh. This must be some kind of joke. That's Addison. This must be some kind of joke. Everyone knows how kind-hearted Gorons are. Oh. There's so much to read in these newspapers. Oh. Huck. Huck. Maybe we can make the Zora sound like Australian. Or Kiwi. Yeah. I have a hard time doing those accents, but I could practice it. Hello there, sir. Say, are you familiar with Zora's domain? I just, it's, j I don't know what I was doing there. It's found just past the Lanayru wetlands to the east. Aww. I used to source fresh fish from the Zora. Robbie has a Kiwi accent. <laughs> but then sludge started falling from the sky and polluting the water. Now they don't catch many fish anymore. Wretched, eh. But enough of that. To happier matter. I guess you should have sounded Canadian if you're saying eh. Wretched, eh? I don't want to make fun of people's accents. Welcome to Nebus's Fine Goods. Please take a look at our carefully curated offerings. Aww. Look at this fine selection of products. Take your time. Ah. I usually like to buy from these guys, like they're real people, and I feel bad about it, but I don't really think I need this. I'll get a lizard, I guess. All of them? Ah. Thank you for your business. Mm. Alright, bye! Oh. I will eagerly await your return. Keep. I don't know if I've seen this guy yet. Keep Nemesis. Horse does not like me. Keep Nemesis fine goods in mind for all your mercantile needs. I will, thank you. I wish you sold arrows. I gotta support- I do feel- I really feel like that. I feel like I'm at like- I feel like I'm at like a street fair or something and someone looks down on their luck and they're like, Oh, I only have rice and cheese. And I'm like, well, I could use some rice and cheese. I mean, I've got- I'm not rich in real life, but I am in this game. Where am I going? Oh yeah, back to the wetlands. Let's just teleport. Oh, my drink is gone. That's alright, we'll drink water. There's a boss bokoblin in here. I don't really feel like fighting. I should, because I need the guts. But I'd rather fight one that's out in the open where I can just throw stuff at it instead of having to actually fight. Because I'm a squishy weenie. Let me out of here. What? I still love that Zelda has a guy named just Robbie. Just straight up, oh my god, this is not a safe place. Just straight up Robbie, not like, 
Xerxes or I don't know. What are they? Neb. What was that guy's name? Neblis or whatever their crazy names are. It's just Robbie. I love it. It's so funny to me. Oh, what's that? There's a Korok thing. Let's try to get it. Everything is respawn. This is not safe. Oh, it was that stuff falling. I was like, oh god, something's gonna shoot me. Oh, I missed. Yay! Robbie is a great name. Yeah, I love it. It's just so plain. Yeah, you found me. I tried really hard. I mean, as an American who is not a professional voice actor, I have somewhat of a difficult time separating between an Australian accent and a New Zealand accent, but I tried really hard to make Robbie sound like he's from New Zealand and Jaren sound like she's from Australia. see me do you oh nice shot I didn't want this I don't want the silver one to come out you guys shut up so fast. The enemies in this are so hard. Meet our Zonite researcher, John Smith. Exactly. <laughs> Here's our doctor, Betty. Like, what? <laughs> here's, here's her assistant, Sarah. Have a hard time distinguishing the two? I think the, from what I, from the little I know, it seems like the difference is in the vowels. But I'm sure, I'm sure if there are any actual Australians or what is, look at those huge dudes. If there are any actual Australians or Kiwis in here, I'm sure my accents sound terrible. I hope, hope, hope that I do not offend anyone because it is not my intention at all. I just really like accents and voices and I'm doing my best, but you know, if it happens to be your accent, you can always tell them to, like, what are you doing? That's not how we sound at all. But I mean, not everybody can just sound like a Californian. <laughs> we already have a few characters with like Valley Girl act or Surfer Guy accents. That not everyone can sound like that. What is this? I'm stuck. Can we hunt with this? Seems cruel. Beam emitter times three. Is that all that's in here? Not to sound ungrateful. I mean, I do, but just because it seems so mysterious, I thought there would be something else in here. Let me out. I should go do that shrine. I'm afraid those hands are over there. I'm really scared of them. They did a very good job of making this game feel dangerous and it's sort of frightening. I wish I could find some more frogs. When I saw this on the map, I thought there would be like a million frogs everywhere. So far, I've been a little disappointed in the density of the frog population. 
Joan Sao Shrine. Deep Force. Joan Sao Shrine. I'm so happy it's not one of those ones where they take my apples away. Alright, let's have a look at what we've got here. Got a ball, got a target. <coughs> Oops. I'm stuck. Oops. So bouncy. So what, like this? Yep. That's fun. It's gonna smash me. Hang on a second. Where he inflates? That's a cute detail. How does it sound if you hit it? Oh, uh, I was hoping to be like. Boom. Here, maybe? That looks too close. There we go. It sounds so heavy. It sounds like it's made of stone. Maybe it's a wooden ball, but I'm not sure why it's quite that buoyant. If so. Hey, princess, how you feeling? Oh. Ooh. Mighty construct bow. 24. Durability up. A powerful bow for a captain construct. Though still fireproof, it's more complex than earlier models. The bowstring is extremely tense and requires great strength to draw. Hooray! I love that. Taking my ball and going home. Hey! This is one way to shield myself. What's this? Look, we got like a pool mat. We can just hang out in here and have a nice relaxing spa day. Ah. Presumably this one will do the same thing. Be like this. I could just use the ball that I brought. Oh, I used to do this in when I played in pools. <laughs> Launch it. You know, getting knocked in the teeth because you're like. <laughs> I can't see. Taking my ball and my surfboard and <laughs> going home.
I know what I'm supposed to do. At least I think so. But could we do something dumber? It's the only shrine they use it in, so if you're gonna miss them, you could always fuse into a shield. Oh, I always forget that's a possible thing to do. Wonder if it causes like a bouncy effect. I do have a bunch of shields that don't have anything fused to them because I forget that you can do that. table on my back. <laughs> I'm gonna, gonna write stuff on it like it's like math class. As you can see demonstrated here, our quarterly profits are down by 0.32%. This is an unacceptable loss for the company. In the future. <laughs> Am I gonna be able to climb that? Doesn't appear so. <laughs> should be able to, I should be able to just lay on my back and float. I shouldn't need to swim. Oops, wrong thing. Will this work? Oops. <laughs> Excuse me? Why isn't it going up? <laughs> what? Huh? Okay, well, maybe I need to do a better job. Gosh, it's like a disaster. <laughs> I can't reach it. Such a hard time with depth perception in this game. <laughs> Jesus, things are violent. Might not work. Okay. Well, at least I'm more stable now. There we go. It's overcomplicating it. High five. You look so cute. Visitor to the Shrine of Light, that which imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. You have done well to reach this place. 
We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. He looks so worried. It's just because of the hair. Alright, it was lovely to meet you too. I have you hope blah, blah blah blah. Hope you have a wonderful evening. We'll hope to see you again sometime. Light of blessing. Alright. Oh, it's 345. May the light of blessing grant the strength you seek. I think we can probably push till four-ish. Oh man. So many of my water bottles are empty. Not for the big one. <laughs> Me and my table. Okay. Let's take a look at this map. So, we haven't really explored this island at all, which I think is probably a good place to start. Because, what is going on with this thing? It seems so loose all the time. Uh, yes, yeah, so we go like north to south. That would probably be a pretty good way for me to try to keep track of where the heck I've been. So, we'll work our way up this coast. I'm pretty sure we're gonna run into those nasty hands. And I think it just saved, but I'm gonna do a little save scum save anyways. I'm about to lose my nighttime speed boost, unfortunately. something gurgling there goes my night speed Why? I think I'm gonna continue running up the coast a bit <laughs> is that a an actual plant I can collect or is this just a decorative thing because it's glowing so much an aerodactyl appeared. Oh, look at this beautiful little grove. I bet there's a monster or something down there. Oh, jeez! Hey! <laughs> he scared me. Let's see, there's a Korok up on this ridge. Oh, God, look what it is. There's that nasty gloom. I hope those hands aren't down there. I'm really afraid of them. If they are, I'm gonna teleport away. I think I see Rivali's pine cone and some mushrooms. Ooh, a frog. Let's change weapons. Let's use this up. Get these plants. Apples. Good. Missed one. Oh yeah, and I keep forgetting about the little dude. What's his name? Tulin. <laughs> Ch 
trying to remember him if we get into any fights. Do we have a picture of you yet? We do. Why are you on that sandbar? Who is that? I don't know if I know that one. Do we have a picture of you yet? Yep, we sure do. This rock looks very suspicious. There's one here, but... I don't really think this is gonna take us there. I think it's over there. Let's just make a weapon out of that then. <clears throat> Might as well. <laughs> Excuse me. Is this close to... Not very close. These statues. So many animals down here. Anything in this tree? don't really want to spend time in the depths, but I do think we should unlock that chasm. Couldn't think of the word for it. We can go help Addison. It's always nice to see him. I'm gonna be so sad when all his puzzles are done. There's a lot of bad guys over here we can fight. Which actually is pretty useful to have them all in one convenient spot like this. This is really cool. I forgot about this little fish bone structure. Uh, it would be pretty useful. I would probably have to take all that stuff up there to him. <sighs> if we need weapons and stuff, we can come <laughs> over here and fight. Discovery. Laneru Wetlands Chasm. Ooh, look, some pose. <laughs> the music sounds way different. Let's change our clothes quickly. <coughs> I wish I had the light hat for this. One of these days I'll get it. I'm cool to land on this mushroom. Take a look around. They told me something. Oh, there's the light route. Well, we might as well go activate it, right? Might as well. I don't see any reason not to. I should have grabbed those pose, I suppose. So funny. Wasnage light root. <coughs> the light root dispelled the darkness and brightened the surrounding area. I wish I could do a long stream. There's some bad guys over there. Oh. This looks like a very difficult fight. Uh, there's a weapon over there. Some pose I would like to have. Ooh, can't see. I'm gonna go try to get those pose real quick. I have a feeling something's gonna jump out and scare me, so I'm sorry if it's loud. <coughs> Ooh, there's a big one over there. Oh, are these all bombs? <gasps> Oh, baby. Now I really think something's gonna get me. 
They tempted me over here with bombs. Is gonna pop up maybe? They might. I said I didn't want to explore down here. Oh jeez. <laughs> and yet here I am. Alright, I wanna I do wanna go back up, I think. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh cutie pie. Because I'd like to kind of keep these separate where I explore the overworld, then I explore the depths, and I just, I'm not ready to be down here yet. It's so gloomy. Like, literally, and just, like, it's so dark and scary. Ooh, bait for fish. That's new. Uh, I actually think I'm gonna take just a very quick pee break. So I'll be right back with you.
Okay, I'm back. Actually, JT, that just links to RC. I don't have my own Discord, and I'm really bad about posting when I go live on there. So, <laughs> you people are welcome to join RC, which is like a community Discord for streamers and artists and a bunch of beautiful, lovely people. But it's not specific to me, and I rarely ever post that I'm live on there. <laughs> I'd say the best way to know when I am going live is just the notifications on Twitch. All right, let's get this back on. All right, and let's get back to exploring. There's Addison. Hi, princess. Hello. Oh, there's some rocks up here. You're my support. He's gonna get trapped in between these rocks. That should work? I'll put another one in the back just to be safe. I can't talk to him. Addison. Oh, it's you. Thanks for your help earlier. I can't see your face. <laughs> I can't see your face. I'm putting President Nuts in here too. But I can't stand here forever. I've got so many more signs to spread around. I don't know what to do. Mm -hmm. What? Are you gonna support him? All right, I'll let go. Da -da -da -da. Look at his face. <laughs> Look at his face. How's the president standing? Ah. That was brilliant. I would have never thought of it. All right, let's get him secure while he's still standing. Oh. Put this right there. Get that fastened and... Ah. Perfect. Ooh, I'll take a flaffy. I think I might already have one. Let's see. Oh, don't. Perfect! With your help, Prisoner Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. It fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Take this with my thanks. Red Rupee. <coughs> also, you must be hungry after all that hard work, right? Let me give you a little something I made myself. Seafood rice balls. Ah, but I still don't feel like you've thanked you enough. This is a little something for my premium collection. A special gift for me to you. It's drugs. Oh, it's bombs. I'll take that too. Ah. <laughs> now I can go to other places and put up more signs. And with that, I'm off. Bye, Addison. I love you. <laughs> You're so bad at construction. And this piece is called... This piece is called... Defiance. This piece is called Defiance. <coughs> My dog is so cute. Most, I mean, not all dogs are cute, but man, I love that dog so much. It fills my heart with joy to see her. I feel like we've pretty much seen this little land mass. I got the Flaffy. You could go over there and do some fighting. Ooh, there's a cave here. Let's do the cave. Yay! Yay! <laughs> I hope there are bats. Oh, hello! Oh my god, I missed. Oh, it's hard. Get off 
the tree! This isn't the time for climbing! I need them to come down here where I can see. The camera's too close. I can't see anything. Ah! Ah! I'm gonna die here. There's too many of them. I need to separate them out a bit. Hey. There, go help me fight. You forgot how to get up? Well, at least there's only one of them now. That helps a lot. You okay, Bubble? Probably need to wrap up my stream pretty soon so I can get her out before fireworks start because I'm sure they will be happening again today. Alright, now we just have one guy to fight so that should be a lot better. Much nicer. There we go. Cool. I'll take it. I thought this was gonna be a full cave. That's alright though. Let's have a look over here. I see some Lizalfos. A Bokoblin. Do I have enough time to fight these guys? Probably not. You okay, baby? It would be smarter to explore this area, but then now that I'm on this landmass, I feel like if I don't explore it, I'm gonna get super duper sidetracked. Oh wow, that's way too far away. What's up, Jamie? How are you doing today? Hope you're well. Lovely to see you. I was about to do some fighting. Probably won't be streaming for too much longer. I don't know why they won't fight each other. There they go. Ooh, this current is bad for me. What does that fool have? Oh. Follow me down here, I dare you. Oh wait, you can! I forgot, I forgot they could swim! Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, date night in just started. Oh yeah. What are they playing, do you know? It's like a pool floaty thing. Hey princess, you okay? Is that my cue that it's time to stop streaming, Bubble? Cooking. Oh. That sounds nice. I cannot get this fool over to that thing. Link, swim, my god. How can you be so bad at this? Hey pretty baby. A fish stick. I like her, but she's growing really fast in popularity. Like two days when I first mentioned she had 30 something viewers, now it's double the- Wow, that's awesome. That's great. Does she mostly cook? Oh, 
and robots too? What is this sparkling? A throwing spear. Missing the hipster stage when we get it there before it got popular. <laughs> it can still be part of my hipster stage. Did it not get you? What? Oh dear. I might be in real big trouble now. I'm not here. No, nothing. Go fight the robots. I can't believe this is working. Okay, they can fight each other. Oh, I'm definitely in your hipster stage. I hope you don't forget me when you hit mainstream. I don't think that's likely to happen. <clears throat> I don't do enough- I don't think I do enough of the stuff that you need to do to get popular. Like, I'm not on social media. I was like, when it was three viewers? I'm not on social media. I don't have a Discord. I don't really, like... I don't pay a lot of attention to what's popular. I just play what I want. I'm not- I just, like... I don't think I do what I would need to do to really get popular. I'm okay with that. Oh, you saw me! saw me too, huh? Wait, maybe they didn't see me. I can't believe I missed all those shots. What the heck? There's a silver one over there. Aw, <laughs> Jamie, that's very kind. Thank you. I don't know if it's gonna happen, but I'm okay with that. I like what I've got right now. I made so many good friends and it's been really good for me. Whoop. Oh, that's a strong one. They're robots, so maybe this would work? No. Seems like it should. Seems like it'd be electrocuted. A ro what about water? Since they give you a, give a robot water or too much electricity, that should probably do it. The silver Lionel is a problem. Maybe we could just blow him off of the thing. Dang it. Oh, did he go in the water? He was like, no, he's still right there and he's gonna get you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, sh I forgot about the robots. I forgot about the robots. <laughs> There we go. That'll do. I can't believe that didn't work. Hey! Stop it! That'll work. There we go. I'm losing all the spoils, but I think that's okay. They will respawn. Strength and Lizzlebow. Ooh. A Lizzlebow with a grip reinforced by metal. The body is made from the branches of a flexible tree that grows near water, which offers some serious destructive power. Oh, I didn't realize I was using this good bow. I can't believe that's all the damage I did with this good bow. Holy moly. I should have probably just saved this one for later, but 
Oh, it's too late now. I think there's anything in the water. There were sometimes in the breath of the breath of the wild. Excuse me. I like all the little shells. Very cute. Soldier construct horn. See what we got. I'm a little surprised there weren't more bad guys over here. Large zone I charge. Oh look! A chest. Hmm, do I want to go for it right now? Maybe. Let's see if we can get it on an ice thing. Hey, this went shockingly well. It's melting, but... <gasps> A knight's bow? Ooh, I might leave this one. And just put a little stamp on the map that there's a chest right here. So maybe we can come back and get it later. Sometimes, when, I'm, when I was playing Bre Breath of the Wild, excuse me, struggling to speak, when I was playing Breath of the Wild, and also sometimes still, it becomes very difficult to find a weapon. Where's the current going? Is that a Hedox? It looks like one. Oh, gross. Look who it is. A whiz robe. Ooh, I see a fish. God, he swims so slow. Look at him. He's the worst swimmer I think I've ever seen. I can't believe a Zora girl wanted to marry this fool. There's some more enemies over here. Maybe I'll stop over here. And we'll pick this up next time we stream it, which may be tomorrow or may not, just depending on how things go tonight. Because I'm pretty much expecting a bunch of fireworks again. Not really looking forward to that, but we have not been getting a lot of sleep, and I'm sure it shows. Oh, I'm wearing a terrible outfit, too. I'm sure it shows. <laughs> I'm getting really tired. I need a good night's sleep one of these days pretty soon, but I doubt if tonight's going to be the night. So I think we'll stop here, and then uh, we'll look at this part of the landmass that's on the Bonet Pond that's on the map. And then we'll continue with our exploration. We've still got a lot to look at. So, let's do a little save. And we'll. Let me bring up that person's stream. And we'll go read them. And so, uh, because things have been so crazy for me, again, I, if you do see me tomorrow, I really doubt if it's going to be on time. It might be, but I doubt it, and there's like a big chance just probably the rest of this week might be a little weird. A date, night, in, and then next week I have a dentist appointment on Tuesday. So you may not see me that day, you may not see me for a few days after that because I often get sick when I leave the house, unfortunately. Um, so let's say some thank yous. And... We'll get you guys out of here. Uh, no, I had a root canal and this tooth and it's got a crown and I think the filling fell out of the bottom of it. It's like, it's not really painful, but it's like slightly painful. And you can see like the dr like perfect drill hole in the bottom of the tooth. So I was like, um, I need to go get that fixed. <laughs> that is not gonna do for me. Uh, thank you, Ixchel is hungry for the follow. Thanks, Jamie Lee Quinn, for the raid suggestion. Thanks, JT, for doing all the mod work. Thanks, everyone, for hanging out and chatting, being lovely as per usual. It's not so bad. It's just... I just don't want it to injure me. Uh, thanks, everyone, for hanging out and being lovely as usual. If I see you tomorrow, I'll see you tomorrow. If I don't see you tomorrow, I'm sure I'll see you probably the following day. And we will most likely be playing Zelda for the rest of the week until Sunday. And then we may play Circles with Pedro, but I'm not totally sure. Yeah, we're going to raid uh, Jamie's suggestion. 
Let me make sure I spell everything correctly. We're gonna go read someone new, so if you can stick around and say hi, that would be good. Jamie said that they are doing some cooking. And so, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day or night, depending on when you're watching this. And maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye!